Hey, my boy, can we normalize saying anything outside of the Jordan 1 and 13 collection is actually fire? It's too many people that's out here talking about, hey, man, I ain't never wearing no Jordans that's outside of the 1 and 13s. Who are you? You got little homies that's out here saying the same thing. Look, y'all was just born after the man retired. So why does that even matter? Look, you got the 14s, 15s, 16s that was eh, 17s raw as hell, 18s, and then you skips until you got to the 21s. 21s was cold too. And then you got the 2009s that I think there was like 190 or $200 or something like that. But y'all talking like these sneakers is not fire. Look, back then, if you had worn any of these sneakers that was outside of the 13 collections, all you needed to do was wear some sweatpants, baggy preferably, a t-shirt, a chain, a fitted cap, a do-rag, or, or a headband, and you was on. It wasn't nothing too much that you needed. It was simple and you had you a fit. Simple as that. But let somebody in GQ, Complex, Hypebeast, or any of these celebrities that y'all know wear these sneakers that's outside of the 13th collection, let them wear these sneakers and I bet a lot of y'all is gonna be on some, man, I used to be a fan of these. I had these when I was just a shorty. Knock it the hell off, bro. But you know what's crazy about that? I think I'm getting a little bit bored or I'm just hitting a plateau with anything from the one to 13 category with this updated type of style and everything before it starts to fade away from the real purpose of him actually wearing the sneaker in the first place. But I mean, that's just for me. I ain't gonna speak for y'all, so I'm gonna let y'all go ahead and say what y'all wanna say. Drop them comments down below, let me know what's up. Hit that like button, hit that pound button, make sure y'all share this video. With that being said, I'll catch up with y'all next time. I'm your homeboy, Cam Quarterbanks. Peace.